Introduction. Today, we're going to show you how to prepare a mouth-watering right New York strip right steak. Here. I'm show you a trick. This cut of beef Actually, is known for its tenderness and dough. rich flavor, making it a Take favorite lemon, choice okay? for steak lovers. Let's get fat. started. Squeeze a lemon, rub some, Ingredients. some lemon juice. Ingredients. One, all over New York strip right steak per person. Salt and black pepper to taste. And what this Olive does, oil or it keeps your fat from, from browning Optional. and garlic cloves, getting all fresh rosemary burnt. and butter for added flavor. So we're gonna check it out. Equipment, grill or stove top yeah. pan. We need to season this Tongs. up. Tongs, meet the so monitor. First thing we need to do is put Plate a little bit of olive oil so for resting. Instructions, one, prep the steak. Take the New York strip sides. steak out of the refrigerator right, and, here I've got some and let it sit at room temperature for about 30 minutes before cooking. This, this right helps ensure here. even cooking. Two, season the steak. SPG, folks, season the up. steak generously on both sides with salt going. and black pepper. All right, so we're going to do the other side just like you this. You can also right add back. minced garlic and fresh rosemary. All right, rosemary. Gang, here we go. I got my Three. DCS grill screaming hot. the grill or pan. And I just if want to tell you, when you got a bone in to high heat. steak of any if you're kind, using a stove top you're going to have a hard time getting grill marks on it high heat. because the bone protrudes from steak. the height of the meat. Four. So it actually keeps the meat from getting on the grates. Place the seasoned steak on the hot grill. get some grill marks fine, but it's not going to be perfect. Sear it for about four or five minutes on each side. So we're going to let this go a little bit. And if you see some flame up like that, that's fine. It's a nice thick steak. For a and I'll let it come to room temperature steak. for uh, Aim about an hour or so. That's what you want to do with a thick steak like this. Degai. And Pick you can also reverse sear this. Degrees. I'm not showing that tonight, when but you could meat definitely reverse sear this. Five. And it would turn out wonderful. Rest the steak. So I'm going to leave the lid open. The steak from the grill I've got this as cranked up as high as I can, so we're probably pushing uh, 900 to 1,000 degrees and let it on rest the uh, temperature to get 10 minutes. off of these uh, This allows the juices to redistribute and keeps the steak juicy and flavorful. We're going to let this go Six, slice and right, serve. Folks, as you can see, After resting, USDA Prime. slice the steak against the grain for maximum content. tenderness. She flames up. Don't Serve worry it about hot it. with your favorite it's sides, three minutes. such as mashed potatoes, asparagus, or a simple put salad. Put it on a little bit different spot. Conclusion. Congratulations. Down a bit just to try You've to just get prepared that a delicious New York strip steak to, to get on that with the right and seasoning and cooking technique. So we're going to let it go for another three minutes. You can enjoy a quality steak we'll in the comfort of your own home. Bon folks, there we go. We're fixing to check some temp. It's still 74, 75 degrees. So I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take it, put it up on the bread rack. We're gonna cook it slow, but we got some grill marks on it, so that's what we need right there. So we're gonna put it up on this bread rack, and we're just gonna cook it indirect for, uh, I don't know, until it's done. I'm trying to get it to about a 125, 135 temp. So let me do that, and we'll be right back. All right, folks, got a little bit of uh, real butter and garlic in here. Just gonna spread this over the top of this steak. I just pulled it off the grill and it's gonna lie. give you a lot of more flavor I tell you. It's good stuff. Fabulous steak. Fabulous steak smells wonderful. We're gonna tent it in full for about uh, 15 minutes. We'll be right back. All right gang, my steak's rested over here. Let's check it out. Let's see what it looks like. Let's just cut right down the middle right here. Oh man. There you go. And I'll tell you another thing, with these uh, USDA Primes, it's still got some pink in the middle here. So this is, this is almost looks like a medium well. But if you let this thing sit, it's like the red will come through. In fact, you can probably see it as we're talking. It's turning more and more red. So this is probably more like a medium, actually. So let's check it out. Let's 